speaker will be um, uh, Professor Yong Sik Kim. Uh, Professor Kim is um, with the MICT Thailand, that's the Ministry of In ICT, Information ICT. and Communication Technology. And Technology with the Korean government? Yes. Okay. He has worked with a, well, he's been with the Royal Korean Navy, IBM Korea, IBM Pacific, a whole list of countries here that I won't go through, but he's um, a widely acknowledged expert on um, those sorts of issues. And therefore, without further ado, I'll go ahead and let you begin. And again, I'll let you know at 10, 5, and 1 minute. Sure. Uh, uh, thank you uh, for inviting me in this uh, very uh, valuable, also very prestigious uh, uh, place. Uh, I'd like to thank you, uh, CITU Dean Pravit, uh, then also Professor uh, Kirapong. Uh, uh, today, uh, I'd like to share the, uh, some of the Korean experience. Uh, I, I think uh, I cannot cover that much about the social economic uh, development part. Uh, but uh, uh, I'm an ICT expert, so I am seeing this change in Korea from ICT uh, point of view. Uh, so uh, uh, I will talk about the, some of Korea's uh, uh, history uh, from economic point of view and the ICT point of view, also some political point of view. Uh, and then the, I like to especially talk about the three areas of impact element uh, which can give a uh, big change to the economy and also uh, uh, social environment. So that is uh, electronic government and uh, industry promotion and the digital divide uh, where every people can utilize this ICT effect. And then I, I like to share some of the lessons uh, from uh, uh, Korea. Uh, actually, I've been in uh, Thailand for, uh, this is uh, my uh, the 11th month. Uh, I came here last October. Uh, but I, I don't know that much about Thailand yet, so I cannot, I'm sorry to, I cannot cover much about the uh, 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 Thailand, but uh, maybe from our Korean experience, uh, you may uh, the, have some comparability uh, from your own or from uh, our uh, group together. Uh, quickly, uh, although you know mo uh, mostly about uh, South Korea, the, I think we are only 20% uh, size of you, uh, Thailand. And the population is uh, 50 million, and uh, uh, our GDP is around 26,000. Uh, especially, the, we are recognized uh, in ICT uh, in in uh, various ways. So that's the, our strategy, our focusing uh, area, how we uh, uh, the, take our position uh, as of today. So. Uh, I think nowadays uh, we cannot live without these uh, the devices, uh, but uh, uh, we are proud that uh, we are providing the, uh, the, the high uh, percentage of these provision uh, from our country. And uh, also we got the good recognition uh, from international, so we got uh, uh, the uh, three consecutive years uh, by ITU in terms of ICT development and also UN e-government. Uh, so uh, still this is a very hot uh, competitive uh, area but uh, uh, in this whole area uh, we are trying very hard so uh, we want to keep our position and our competitiveness uh, in this global age. So, 
nowadays, uh, uh, because of this uh, impact from ICT, I think our life, our society is uh, changing. Maybe without line, I don't know <laughs> how you communicate to each other, to your family, to your friends, to your boss. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, uh, so uh, I think Korea and now in Thailand, the BTS Korea subway is uh, almost same. The everybody is uh, they don't have a time to look the people. They don't have a time to see beautiful ladies. <laughs> They have uh, only the, their smartphone, tablet. So they, they are doing something yeah? uh, while they are traveling. Uh, and the, from uh, uh, business side, uh, this uh, mobile banking and the smart payment and uh, even public transformation, uh, public uh, transportation. The, especially the uh, Koreans are called as hot tempered or not patient. So uh, without knowing what time the next bus is coming, uh, we uh, cannot wait. So uh, the, we, we have uh, all this information, what time my bus will come. If I cannot wait for the time, I, I have to take a taxi or some other uh, transportation. So uh, uh, actually, we, we, we cannot say this make uh, people or human beings uh, uh, happier than before. Uh, as much as we have uh, this type of technology, I think we, we are uh, becoming more busy and busy. And, uh, but uh, the clear thing is uh, without uh, this technology, we, we cannot survive in the current uh, the world. So that was uh, uh, today's Korea, but uh, what was Korea before? I think uh, this was uh, when I was uh, uh, born. I was born after Korean War. So this is a very, com very, the, uh, uh, the, how can I say, maybe it is very friendly uh, looking to me because I was grown up uh, just like uh, in this uh, type of house. Even I was born in Seoul, Seoul was uh, like that. Uh, so uh, the, from uh, economy development uh, point of view, our uh, best objective is economy from, from that situation. So. Uh, although we had uh, some uh, talk about the uh, military coup, in 1961 we had uh, one general had a uh, military coup. His name was uh, Park Jong Hee, and uh, he became he took power and became he beca he was in the president for uh, 19 years in very strong dictatorship. Uh, but. Uh, uh, he, he was uh, uh, very much focused on the economic development. Maybe that is how he can survive in the power. So he had uh, uh, the, uh, many initiatives. Uh, so the, maybe the, the, this tw out of 12 initiatives, the white color uh, is uh, uh, his uh, main major uh, action items. So uh, I, I think we were uh, lucky and also we said that we worked very hard to follow him because there is no other option for our country at that time. Uh, so uh, uh, from these uh, 12 initiatives, uh, he uh, uh, showed very clear uh, the result. Uh, so uh, this uh, strong leadership with vision and uh, target-oriented five-year economic development plan, 
and also uh, candle spirit with the new community movement. This is a kind of some spirit change uh, movement. And export oriented industrial strategy, crisis construction, uh, and infrastructure building and electrification, and uh, uh, loan diplomacy, uh, because we need uh, money to uh, develop nations. Uh, and uh, we uh, the, had a uh, jabber, uh, like uh, Samsung or LG, Hyundai. Uh, we we make make a big uh, the uh, the power uh, to to small uh, the companies. So this this was uh, uh, the some of the point that uh, how. Uh, Korea become competitive. So, in uh, in uh, summarize, in summarizing the his uh, uh, the focus is uh, uh, he had a three uh, triad. So uh, from government side, he had a, a very strong leadership factor, and uh, from uh, the private sector side, he uh, the. Uh, uh, support entrepreneur uh, through the innovation factor, and also uh, he utilized the uh, labels uh, through the hardworking uh, people. So uh, this uh, combined uh, three triad, triad uh, the brought us a synergy effect. So this is the uh, combined power of the Korean triad achieved national development goals. Uh, and uh, his uh, uh, demand to the people is uh, these three, diligence, self-help, and cooperation each other. So this was uh, kind of successful when we developed our nation. So uh, in Korea, uh, socio-economic development, uh, this was the uh, major part. So I think that now we achieved uh, uh, the current level, although we have uh, many problems, still uh, we are struggling to take off. Uh, uh, so if I just summarize the, our uh, economy and sociology take off, we had uh, uh, this uh, point. So from politics uh, 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 and the society part, so if you see here, 1992, we had a first civilian president. So only 22 years ago. So it's not that long. Yeah. Uh, but uh, this was also uh, the, this civilian president. This uh, brought our economy uh, taking off a point as well. Uh, and uh, from society-wide, uh, the, there is uh, some uh, the event like uh, Seoul Olympics or the football or World Cup game. So that is helping the uniting our people and uh, giving some uh, more chances. So uh, again, uh, summarize. This is a summarized chart of our economy and. Uh, there is a two uh, big take-off side. Uh, so one was uh, our uh, uh, main industry development part, left side, and the uh, right side is uh, we had uh, uh, the financial crisis in 1997. That was uh, very serious. So, but uh, uh, so our economy, our income was uh, tumbled down. Uh, but uh, we use this ICT as a taking off uh, engine. So we had a very strong policy to utilize ICT. So this uh, uh, the help uh, the, our economy uh, to uh, take back in a certain level. Uh, so uh, I, I think maybe if I just summarize the, uh, still our economy, I'm not economist, but from in general uh, point of view, uh, I think Korea is still uh, we are highly influenced by the state. 
So the government push, uh, government policy law, uh, this is uh, very highly impacting the, our uh, economy. And uh, again, I said the uh, export-oriented industry and uh, uh, relying on the human resource. Uh, because uh, Korea, we don't have any natural resource at all. We have only human resources, so we utilize the, all the humans. Uh, uh, and uh, back to ICT, the, what was the uh, major factor uh, to uh, develop the nation in economical way uh, and sociological way? Uh, there is uh, three areas. Uh, so first one is uh, e-government, uh, and the second one is uh, industry promotion, IT industry, and then the society expansion. Uh, and uh, there is uh, uh, the base line, base for these three pillars. So this is infrastructure. So like a broadband network, and the human resource, and the standard uh, activities. So uh, I like to show some example of how we put focus on these three areas. So uh, actually, this e-government is, uh, is if I just simply say it is a computerization of government process. So uh, the government, uh, if government is not uh, efficient, transparent, not productive. And uh, it is impacting all areas, private sector, academy, and all people's lives. So the, the e-government is uh, very important in, in terms of that. And uh, uh, after you computerize the, your government uh, business process, you got the experience. And uh, you need to uh, convert that experience into business. You should make money from your uh, experience. So we uh, turn this experience into our IT industry. So uh, industry promotion uh, is uh, uh, another important pillar. And uh, also the, we need to reduce this divide. Still the urban people, maybe it is same in everywhere. The Bangkok people, they know they utilize this whole the ICT devices. But if, you, if we go to the, some northern side, maybe some south side, mountain area, maybe still the many people cannot have opportunity to use. So government need a special uh, effort to uh, support them. So this is a uh, society expansion. And the infrastructure is uh, maybe no need. So, in this, uh, uh, four is a major policy uh, to develop economy and society uh, from ICT uh, uh, point of view. And uh, uh, I think, so I, 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 uh, I summarized these uh, cases in Korea, how we make a e-government, how we uh, uh, make industry promotion, how we reduce the uh, digital divide, uh, but uh, maybe because of time constraint, I, I will not uh, cover all of this. But uh, uh, in uh, uh, industry promotion, actually the economy is uh, from all developing nation. It is the most important subject. Uh, so when you uh, develop our economy, the ICT was the key. And uh, if you see in 1980, uh, we put a lot of focus on the research and development of uh, these electronic uh, systems. So uh, we start from the, uh, the TDX, telephonic switching system, and the uh, uh, memory devices, and uh, uh, also the mobile CDMA, and uh, broadband, and uh, there is a new uh, technology. So uh, I think this was a very effective because at that time, 
only few country, US or Japan or some Sweden, Norway, those countries are uh, invest these areas. Of course, uh, the other uh, the EU countries as well. But uh, Korea was uh, nobody think about to invest this at that time. So when you start this type of research and development, the many countries said, uh, you, you cannot do it. You are not capable to do it. But uh, we, we had a very strong uh, the initiative from the uh, powers. And uh, so I think, uh, uh, I think this is still effective in any country because the continue will, will go forever. The, our life is uh, limited, but the, our next generation generation is continuing. So maybe from as of today, if you see some uh, future uh, area, I think uh, this is uh, still the, uh, very important and uh, high potential to any countries. Especially Thailand, you have a very big potential. So. Uh, uh, and also there is some uh, other uh, initiatives uh, in ICT sector. Uh, so uh, our the economy cycle was uh, changed from the light industry to heavy industry and also high tech uh, industry. So uh, and then the, this was a, a kind of some uh, digital divide initiatives uh, from government. So. Uh, our ministry and the local government and the village, they had uh, uh, the effort together. Uh, so they uh, made uh, some uh, information network village. So the, this village is uh, usually from mountainside or fishery uh, area where the people cannot have uh, enough uh, opportunity to access. So. Uh, they give us uh, some uh, the the infrastructure and uh, subsidy and uh, uh, training programs and uh, also even they can use electronic commerce uh, because each village they have their special product so they start to have uh, some e-commerce so after this movement definitely we reduce we narrow the digital gaps uh, between the rural and the... Uh, uh, at the same time, we focus on the city also. So this is uh, uh, one uh, good report from ITU. Uh, the Seoul was uh, uh, selected as uh, ITU as a uh, case study. So I think this was uh, where uh, the, uh, described about how the city uh, can be improved uh, from this IT technology. And then the, uh, this smart device is, uh, uh, this is uh, uh, the huge impact to our life uh, from uh, the good governance to the economy and the society side. So there is uh, uh, some examples of how we made this. And the infrastructure is a uh, uh, it is a base of all. So uh, you know we are all enjoying the football. So if you want to have a good football team, first thing you need to make a playground, football ground. Without football ground, you cannot expect. So this broadband is like a, uh, that base. And then the, we are continuing to have a global relations uh, through this ICT. So we have uh, many uh, collaboration. Uh, so this is uh, one example of uh, EU. So uh, although this is some old story, but uh, we are continuing this type of uh, collaboration. And also we have uh, uh, many ICT event uh, in, in Korea. Uh, so. Uh, I think uh, these are the, our government's roles in the ICT uh, technology. So uh, I think this is uh, what I just uh, uh, explained. And uh, also 
the reason why we can utilize this ICT or, or ICT is the most effective in this area is uh, uh, the, we can utilize uh, higher human resources and also this ICT give an impact to all other industries. So if you like to see automobile, automobile was a mechanical industry before. But uh, if you got a new car, I think that most of control is by electronics, uh, information technologies. So, uh, and also this uh, ICT is uh, uh, very easy to contribute uh, to the economy and uh, low entrance criteria in terms of investment uh, money and uh, high collaboration. But, uh, Maybe uh, there is uh, still uh, some uh, positive and uh, negative point from our ICT-driven uh, economy side. Uh, uh, I, I think this is, uh, uh, we cannot say this is good or bad, uh, but uh, uh, the, I think we are st still uh, too much uh, uh, controlled by government uh, and also uh, technology uh, oriented uh, and uh, some result oriented and uh, uh, private sector or community initiative agent balancing is uh, also some preferred and uh, some appropriate technology. I think iPhone 6 is coming and uh, Galaxy uh, Alpha, Galaxy Alpha is also coming. But uh, still, I'm using Galaxy Note 1. <laughs> uh, but it was, uh, uh, it was, uh, came out only two years ago. And it has a uh, LTE technology. But it is already very old one. Uh, so I think from the government point of view, some the social point of view, uh, we need to have some balance on this uh, uh, technology as well. And uh, I, I think uh, this is uh, not only uh, in any country context, but I, I just uh, put this for in Thailand context in general. So I think uh, Thailand, you, you have a very big strength and opportunity. So in terms of human resources, and uh, 70 million population is a huge market by yourselves. And uh, still the penetration of ICT is low. And uh, so there are uh, opportunities, especially in the global opportunity. Uh, I, I'm not sure yet, but the uh, AEC, ASEAN Economic Community, is uh, coming uh, from next year, 2015. Uh, I know there is uh, some negative uh, uh, feedback as well, but, but if you see EU, if you see the America, uh, the continents, uh, the, the regional block, I think ASEAN also is a very big uh, potential. And uh, Thailand is the most attractive country in terms of foreign investment also. So these are the all uh, the, the very good uh, point of your uh, future uh, potentials. Okay, uh, so I, I think um, this presentation uh, I uh, took many from uh, government side and uh, also some from uh, my friend. Uh, and uh, this one I, I will just show you. This is uh, one uh, as appendix. There is one internet interesting paper uh, by Stephen uh, Fenson uh, from Arizona University. Uh, there is a CSPO. The, the, he he uh, had a good uh, study comparing Brazil and uh, Korea. So uh, at that time, these two countries are both under military rule. Uh, uh, so I think uh, maybe uh, if you have some time to uh, 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 take a look and uh, maybe this can be uh, some uh, lessons uh, for you as well. Okay. Thank you.
Thank you.